Hi there, welcome to a new edition of Cornell's Corner. Today we're going to talk about fighters, MRI, and yeah, just after the win of uh, Wyndham Clark's um, in the US uh, Open, he won with a with a counterbalance putter. So for those of you, for those of you who doesn't know what a counterbalance putter is, I'm going to explain that for you, and then yeah, just going through about um, MRI, moment of inertia. So talking about the, the counterbalance putter. Uh, what that basically is, it is the putter has a lot more weight at the bottom of the head. It's normally a mallet putter with a lot more weight. So, um, and then because of the weight at the bottom, they need to make the shaft longer so you don't feel all the weight while putting. So that's why it's a counterbalanced putter. That's also why they have the longer grip on to add more weight to the back of the club. So you don't feel the weight in your stroke. Um, and then going to a moment of inertia, that is the, the impact the ball has on the putter face when you stroke it. So basically the more weight you putter you will have to the sides of your putter and to the back of the putter, the less face rotation you'll have of off-center strikes will get your ball closer to the hole of off-center strikes. So the higher the MRI, the more forgiveness there is in the putter itself. 